Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Joey, aka Nuke, and today in this video we're going to be talking about Dallas Cowboys. Uh, particularly, we're going to be talking about David Irving. Now, if you follow Cowboys news or the Cowboys team in general, you'll know that uh, pretty recently one of our best defensive linemen, uh, David Irving, was caught using PEDs. If you don't know what PEDs is, it's like steroids. or It stands for Performance Enhancing Drugs. So he, he was caught using them. Um, last season, this dude was a beast, all right? He was incredible. So we are all pretty bummed out about it. Now, he's getting it. He's, he's, he's scheduled for an appeal to where he's basically going to prove that um, either he didn't use them or that, I don't know. I don't know what his appeal is for. Uh, I don't know anything about that. What I do know is that it's going to give the rookies, if he... If he loses his appeal, it's going to give the rookies a chance to shine, basically. It's going to give them a chance to step up and make an impact on this team. Now, even if he doesn't uh, lose his appeal, if he wins his appeal, he's going to come back and he's going to do the same thing that he did last year, hopefully. And hopefully he's learned not to use these. So, it's going to give the rookies a chance to come in and prove that they deserve to be on this team. They belong on this team. Now, I'm always rooting for underdogs. I always root for our rookies and every rookie out there because, you know, they're changing their lives. Their lives are being changed. But I really, really hope that this new rookie class we got this season makes as big an impact as the rookie at the rookies from last season. For example, as you know, Ezekiel Elliott, Dak Prescott, and Malik Collins, and a handful of others. And so another person I'm really looking at is uh, Taco, and I'm also looking at um, Jalen Smith. Now, Jalen Smith, we, we drafted him uh, last year, and he hasn't played uh, a down for the Dallas Cowboys yet. Now, they're saying that his nerves are firing, which is good, which is a good thing, and that he's you know able to do stuff. Now, we don't see a lot of it on camera because I don't, I don't know why we don't see a lot of it on camera. I think it's because the, the Cowboys are trying to hide uh, his abilities from the media for whatever reason so that maybe like other teams can't see him or... Because maybe they're telling they're not they're not telling us the truth. Or, I don't know. I hope that's not what it is. I hope it's just so that other teams don't see his abilities. But uh, Jalen Smith is saying is being said that he's going to play this next season, which I hope he does. I, I've said that in uh, in past videos already. But uh, I'm I'm really looking at uh, Taco Charlton and Ryan Switzer. Those are my two. Uh, that I think are going to just blow everyone away and just kick some major butt. Now, if they don't, will I be bummed? I mean, yeah, but you know the draft is a is a risky is a risky business, and you know sometimes players don't work out as good as uh, as they thought. For example, Brian Bosworth. If you know anything about him, he was voted one of the all time draft busts. He was terrible. He was absolute crap. He did well in college, but he was crap. Um, but anyway. I digress. So this new rookie class is going to get a chance to really shine because of this whole David Irving thing. And uh, like I said, I hope I hope he wins his appeal and he comes back and he's a beast as he was last year. Um, so anyway, guys, I want to make this quick little video for you. Uh, leave a like if you like this video. Uh, comment if you have any questions or you just want to say hey. And uh, don't forget to don't forget to subscribe. And uh, other than that, guys, peace.